Leaks around the house waste water and money. A homeowner should check for leaks in and around the house. Check for areas that are wet all the time. Check for toilet leaks. If you hear water running, or if your water bills are higher than average, you might have a leak. In this video, we're focusing on outdoor leaks. Let's take a look. A good way to determine if you have a leak is to check your water meter. First, turn off everything inside and outside the house that uses water. Next, find your meter. It's probably near the street with a concrete lid. Open it and check the meter. There's a sweep hand, flow dial, and a meter register with a row of numbers similar to a car odometer. If the sweep hand or flow dial is spinning, then you may have a leak. Or maybe you didn't turn all the water off. Check to make sure that everything's off. Then, check the meter register. Write all of the numbers down, including the white numbers on the black background, the number on the clock face, and the number of tick marks after it. Wait three to four hours. If the numbers change, then you probably have a leak somewhere. Now where's the leak? To check, turn off the house valve. If the spinning continues, the leak is outside. If the spinning stops, the leak is inside. Let's check for leaks outside the home. Some are easy to spot. Others could be hiding. For the easy ones, look for leaky sprinklers, cooling water, and broken irrigation lines. For hidden or silent leaks, you need to be a detective. Check irrigation valves for leaks. They're often buried with an exposed cover. Open it and look for leaking or pooling water. Look for wet areas on your property that do not dry up. This can indicate a service line or irrigation leak underground. It is important to fix leaks. Unrepaired leaks can lead to property damage, cost money, and waste water. Some repairs are easy and may simply require a wrench and a new washer. Others might require a professional. 